Hi guys, Declan here. Uh, we're going to do a football session this evening. Uh, it's going to be about 20 minutes long. It's ideally for a uh, child and their parent or child and their sibling um, to do all the exercises. We're going to break it down into six uh, three minute blocks. So if you have a timer for three minutes, um, it helps. Um, variety of activities, we'll explain them as we go along and we'll also post up um, a list of the activities etc as well. Okay, thank you, we're going to get going now. Uh, the first drill is a handling drill just to get a touch on the ball. So we're going to get the ball and we're going to rotate it about our body clockwise and anti-clockwise. So we're going to go 10 each way. Are we ready? Go. 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And let's go the other way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, the next exercise, same thing. We're going to figure of eight between our legs, okay? So, go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And let's go the other way. Three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Next exercise is a tennis ball as a slither throw attack. Okay. So we're going to throw out the balls. So we're going to catch it with one hand and throw it with the other hand and move around. Okay. We're going to go to ten throws on the right, ten catches on the left. Okay. So ready? You're catching with your right. You're catching with your left. Sorry. Okay. Go. Moving round. Four. I'm lucky. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Oh. Don't worry. Nine. Ten. So we're going to be going the other way. Throw it with our left, catch with our right. Oh. <laughs> Doesn't matter, keep going. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay? Okay, this time we're going to solo over and solo back. We're going to go over twice and back twice, okay? Ready? Go! Take our four steps in between. Okay. This is a warm-up, so there's no mad rush. Try your opposite foot as well, your other foot, okay? Push it out of front of you and take your four steps. So what I'm going to do is throw the ball 10 times for Rory at different angles, over his head, to the side, drop it on the ground. He's going to get it and he's going to hand pass it back to me, okay? And then we're going to swap over, okay? Are we ready? I'm going to count them as well. Ready? One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. 
Eight. Nine. Go on, pick, pick. Ten. Good boy. That's it. And we'll swap over. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Let's swap over. The person that you're throwing it to, make sure you're on your toes. You're not flat footed. You try and be on your toes. Okay, the next exercise is just the plank. Um, it's a core exercise and a glute exercise for strength. So I'm just going to demonstrate it first. I'm going to set up on our elbows, okay? Straight line between head and toe. You're squeezing your uh, core and you're squeezing your glutes. So you're holding, you're still breathing at the same time. Okay, so if I set it up from the front, your arms aren't together like that squeezing. You want the tension in your, in your, in your core and in your glutes. So face your palms up like that, arms apart, okay? So we're gonna go like that, okay? Right, let's go and do the exercise, Rory. So we're gonna do 10 seconds, break for 10 seconds, and 10 seconds again, okay? So you count, okay? Are you ready to go? go. Count. One, yeah. two, three, four. Squeeze everything. Five. everything straight line from head to toe okay relax for okay we're gonna go again this time we're gonna raise our hands and, and tap each other nice and controlled okay nice and slow and keep everything nice and tight in a straight line from head head to toe okay you ready so we're gonna do eight you ready so one two Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, and relax. This time we're gonna go a bit further apart. So you're gonna to have to reach. Okay. You ready? One, two, three, four, control, five, six, seven, eight. Are you good? Okay. Now we're gonna do some, some sprints or some chases. Okay. So we're gonna put a bib, just tuck it into your shorts, okay? Rory's gonna start at the line. I'm gonna start two set two steps behind him. Okay, he's gonna shout go. And I'm gonna chase and try and get his bib. He's to get to the line for me. Done. Let's go again. Walk back, get lots of recovery. Okay, you're on me now. I'm shouting go. Just come a bit closer. Go! Walk back and get recovered again. Gonna get you this time. Go! <laughs> Nearly.
jump. Go! Okay. So, so what we're going to do here, I'm going to throw the ball. Rory's going to face that way. I'm going to throw the ball over his shoulder. He has to react to it and get it before it bounces a second time. Okay? So we're going to do, do the first one now. You ready? Yeah. Good boy. Well done. Probably challenge you more. Throw it up more, but kind of up, if you know what I mean. Well done. You ready? I'm going to throw for, for. You go one more. We're going, to, we're going to challenge you this time. All right, you ready? Go, go, go. Well done. Good job. This is a hand passing game, okay? When I receive the ball from Rory, I have to hop on my left around the pole while he hops on his right around another pole. So, so when you have the ball, you hop on your left. When you don't have the ball, you hop on your right. Both of you go around the pole on receiving and passing the ball. Are you ready? We're going to do this for a minute. Okay? Ready? Go! This is a hand passing drill. Okay, we're just going to go through the basics again. So when you're hand passing the ball, you extend your, if you're right handed, you extend your left hand. Okay. You step forward with your left foot. You strike with your fist closed and you're striking through the ball from your pocket. Okay. So you're stepping forward. Okay. We're going to do a drill. We're going to go up and down three times. On that way, Rory's going to use his left, and I'm going to use my right going that way, and vice versa on the way back. And just go around the pole, we're going to do it three times continuously, and then we're going to take a break for one, one walk, and then we're going to do it again. We ready? Let's go. Try and do it a bit faster this time, okay? Ready? Let's go. One. Two. 
So what we're going to do here, we're going to go out around the orange pole and we're going to kick pass back with our right foot. We're going to go back, come back and get the ball, go out to the, or to the yellow pole, come back, our kick pass of our left foot, come back and get it. And we're going to do three at each pole, okay? So I'm going to drim a straight one and then Rory's going to go and do his, okay? You ready? You have to be ready. So, solo out. Kick pass back. Come and get it. Follow out. Kick pass back. Come and get it. And then go again. Okay? So three each pole, Rory, when you're ready. Go. Red ball. Come and get it. Good ball. Come and get it. Come and get it. Good ball. Come and get it. Come and get it. Good ball. And that's it. Well done. Good job. This is the last activity, okay, this is a one-on-one -on -one drill. So what Rory's gonna do, he's gonna solo up around that pole. I'm gonna run down around the, the yellow pole. He has to get between those two yellow poles and I have to defend them, okay? Just a couple of points about when you're defending them, okay? Don't be square as in straight on. Push him onto his bad foot. So lead at one foot, okay? Keep your hands up to dispossess the ball and move your feet, be on the balls of your feet, okay? So now we're gonna demonstrate it. So you shall go. Go. Wait, I thought we were walking through. I remember walking through. Okay, that's it. You go again. Go. Okay. Twelve over. Well done. Good effort. Oh. Thank you very much. That's the training session complete. I hope everyone is keeping well during this time and their families as well. Um, I'd encourage you to get your parent or sibling involved. It's all the drills are ideally for two people. Um, keep practicing, have fun, and if anybody has any questions, uh, get in touch with myself or Alan Campbell. Um, thank you very much and uh, Take care.